Hey everyone, my name is Mike, and in this video, I'll be showing you how to do Razor Fen Crawl. I keep wanting to say Razor Fen Crawl, but Razor Fen Crawl, um, which is located in the southwest corner of Southern Barrens, I believe it is. So this is how you get into the dungeon, and then I, it's a little glitchy this loading screen thing, so that's why I went through the portal, but it didn't take me through right away. But anyway, when you come off, make sure you take a right from the entrance, because if you go left, you'll just go into a dead end. So in this video, it is a little bit sped up, but it's still a speed where you can see where I'm going on, on the map and in the gameplay itself. All the mobs in this level, or in this dungeon, are about level mid-30s, I think, mid-30 elites. So I think around level 50 to 60, you should start being able to solo this. Uh, and in, in this video as well, I could pull the entire dungeon and just go to the last boss and not worry about anything, but I decided I wanted to play a little bit more stealth, so that's why if you see me turning around to make sure everything's dead, that's... That's why, because I didn't want to have to deal with anything uh, following me. But overall, this dungeon doesn't take very long. I think it took, uh, with going in and running back, which I show you at the end of the video, I'll show you how to get back outside if you wanted to go back to Southern Barrens, maybe do Razor, Razor Friend Downs or something like that. I'll show you how to get back. But uh, it's, I think, seven, eight-ish minutes, not even. So uh, this, is, this is one of the dungeons that it... It looks like it's very confusing, the layout, but it's actually pretty simple, and it's actually pretty easy to get to the last boss. You don't have to kill any other bosses to get to the last boss, and it's pretty straightforward. They have, like, a direct path into them, so it's not that bad, but in this cave, there's a bunch of bats, and I don't know. I keep feeling like they have this weird, weird, like, aggro radius, but they don't, as far as I know. I just kept, like, like they kept flying towards me. I'm like, oh my god, they're gonna aggro, but they didn't, so that was good. Uh, again, this is another dungeon that, well, I guess every dungeon, if you buy some, some speed pots, you'll get through this a lot quicker. Uh, and if you're a warrior, if you're like, for example, I'm a warrior, so I can heroic leap, I can uh, intervene to my banner, I can charge enemies. But this is the last boss right here, Chargla, whoever. So you kill that person, I go ahead and loot that, so you know who the last boss is. And this is how you get down. So from that boss, you'll jump down the ledge, and you'll go down here where these three guys are. And make sure you just go left and follow the pigs basically so you're going to be going pretty much the same way you came uh just you're underneath all the vines you're in like the 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 hound pit and as far as i know the way i went was the quickest route to get to the last boss but i'm pretty sure you can't get to the last boss going this way but uh, at the end of this video there's also a large end slate for you to click on if you want to go see the other dungeon walkthroughs so feel free to click on that um and then anyway so going back to the video though you're going to keep going through here, and uh, as you see on the left, or on the right side, but also, on the right side also rather, but on the left side there is this vine that you're going to climb up. Momentarily, here we go. So I climb up on the vine, and then you're just going to follow the vine, and it will lead you, basically turn you right around, and it will take you right back to the exit, or the entrance, I guess, of this dungeon. Anyway, my name is Mike. Thank you very much for watching. Like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Have a great day.